incompetence. That's what America has become. As far as I've reconciled, I've noticed in the latest news that we as Americans are accepting a, a deal with Syria to accept 10,000 Syrian refugees and we don't even know who's, who these people are and as uh, one of the uh, candidates for presidency, Mr. Donald Trump, said that in a press conference, we don't, we don't even know, they might be armed, dangerous, they're, most of them are men, there's not, a, I mean, we, it would be different if there were a mix of men and women, so this is totally incompetent and lazy of us to accept this type of behavior in our society, and either we can lay down like jellyfish, or we could stand up for what's right and what we believe in is to be true. So, I don't know, I don't know the whole deal and I don't know what we're going to do, but this is really, really dangerous. And, you know, the numbers keep going up. It was, first it was 10,000, then it was 20,000, you know, 100,000, 900,000, a million, millions, you know, millions and trillions. So, this is something that's just been on my heart and on my mind. I mean, we don't even know what we're getting into and it's really a dangerous situation. It's really a dangerous situation to put on the American people and it's just totally uh, incompetent and it's totally uh, it's, it's laziness of us to do this and um, I don't even know if we, I don't even know uh, if we know what we're doing so I mean stupid, stupid incompetence of our, of our society, you know, instead of waking up and realizing what we're doing, we're, we're asleep, and that's just what I think about it, and that's just what my whole take on the whole situation is, and I'm just really, really applauded by our, by what our, what our government's doing in our lives.